Welcome to Company Showcase, an advertising feature on HowStreet.com. I'm Jim Goddard. I'm speaking with Jared Laserson. He's the president and CEO of MGX Minerals. Welcome back to the show, Jared. Hey, Jim. How are you? I'm doing great. What kind of an update do you have for us about MGX? Uh, big week this week. We announced uh, technology that uh, had been uh, uh, had developed, but um, really a, a showcase of the uh, acquisition uh, of uh, uh, Zingnix, a zinc air uh, battery flow battery company, um, acquired last month. Uh, the big announcement was really to showcase their um, proprietary and patented technology that deals with the largest, most significant hurdle in zinc air uh, flow batteries, which is the buildup or the generation of uh, zinc dendrites, which is a 3D snowflake uh, shaped particle uh, that can build up, uh, draw down the zinc, which is the primary uh, charged uh, element in the electrolyte. So you're both drawing fuel and you're uh, doing the equivalent of, of corroding your uh, membranes and clogging your membranes within the fuel cell. Uh, this was uh, solved, and actually those dendrites are, are then able to be reprocessed as fuel, so there's no actual loss of fuel, nor is there interference with the membrane. Uh, this is proprietary and patented technology, so we made a uh, an announcement about that, really paving the way for uh, the uh, redesign and mass production of zinc air batteries, a very low-cost alternative to uh, lithium ion or uh, the equivalent vanadium uh, flow battery, uh, uh, far superior in many ways than lithium ion. The one issue really is just uh, they're a bit clunky. Um, they are uh, you know large, not huge in terms of footprint, but much larger uh, than um, uh, lithium ion in uh, the case of electronics or electric vehicles. Really, no application, but ideal for low cost mass storage uh, to support solar, wind. Um, grid power uh, augmentation to replace or augment diesel generators. Uh, I really believe, we really believe that this is going to be the go-to moving forward in terms of uh, mass storage, uh, not lithium ion as, uh, uh, as some, uh, some groups might, uh, might have you think. Can you give us a bit of a background about MGX Minerals for our new listeners? Uh, sure. MGX Minerals uh, really now has become uh, all things energy related without actually being producers of energy. So we are moving our silicon projects ahead, uh, for example, to support production of uh, solar panels. So the silicon, the high-grade quartzite, uh, we're the largest uh, holder of, of non-frac sand quartzite uh, in Western Canada and the U.S. Uh, on the other side of the solar panels, like I mentioned, we are now into uh, uh, low-cost mass storage. So we don't produce the solar panels and generate the power, uh, but we do uh, look to produce the uh, the, the silicon and um, uh, are now moving towards mass production of mass storage. So just to kind of rattle it off, uh, we are in uh, lithium with uh, some of the most advanced lithium extraction technology in the world. Uh, but again, we don't make the batteries, we don't make the cars, but we look to uh, uh, produce lithium uh, and have produced lithium on the uh, on the pilot scale uh, and are just ramping for uh, commercial deployment of our lithium extraction technology. A uh, big game changer, paradigm shift, uh, no more solar evaporation ponds uh, or limited solar evaporation ponds uh, and very low cost um, uh, CapEx, uh, especially compared with what it now takes to build a new solar evaporation circuit, uh, you know, a square mile of double line ponds. Uh, this is probably going to be a thing of the past over the next year as we uh, commence deployment. Our first deployment we're expecting uh, within 60 days here. Uh, we're just finishing up uh, flow and commissioning, flow testing and commissioning of the uh, of the system. Uh, we're in magnesium. Uh, we're weeks away from a, a PEA on our 8 million ton measured and indicated uh, magnesium oxide, which is the the basic compound of, of magnesium uh, project just outside of uh, Cranbrook, B.C., uh, largest new uh, magnesium uh, project in North America. Again, magnesium, uh, lighter, stronger, a third lighter than aluminum uh, and stronger. Uh, if you want lighter uh, uh, vehicles, lighter aircraft, um, uh, you're going to need a, more magnesium. So, again, all things energy, but not actually producing energy. That's how I would describe MGX these days. Uh, we're the largest lithium brine landholder uh, by acreage in North America, 2 million acres, um, uh, mineral claims or options. Uh, so it's a, it's a, it's a broad 
uh, company. We also hold some traditional assets. Uh, we have 100,000 acres of oil and gas and mineral uh, lithium-related leases in Utah. Um, we call that a petrolithium. So we're uh, big in all things energy, advanced materials, as well as um, some traditional energy and, uh, um, and, and storage and energy technology assets. Where is MGX traded and under what symbols? Uh, MGX is traded on the Canadian Securities Exchange, CSC, uh, under XMG, and on the OTCQB under MGX, uh, MF, as well as uh, in Frankfurt uh, under 1MG. Jared, where can people find out more information about MGX Minerals? Uh, the best place is the website, uh, mgxminerals.com, but we also have a huge amount of media coverage. We're a very interesting company, uh, so even a Google search or uh, a cursory Google search will uh, provide you with a lot of very interesting third-party analysis. Uh, the reason I say that is because different media groups uh, even within the energy space, have very different takes and very different questions. So uh, third party, I would search as well as, uh, as on the website. Jared, thank you so much for the update. Thank you, Jim. I've been speaking with Jared Laserson. He's the president and CEO of MGX Minerals. We were speaking on January 11th. I'm Jim Gotti. Comments made on Company Showcase are an expression of opinion only and should not be construed in any manner whatsoever as recommendations to buy or sell any financial instrument at any time. Archived online at HowStreet.com. Company Showcase is a production of How Street Media Incorporated.